So for you to contact a customer support on 1688 to report some case, you just have to come to the top right here from your profile. Then it load up this page. So the next thing you need to do is to go to your Google Translate. Then you need to type in Chinese and uh, you need to type in English. Why the Google Translate will help to translate to Chinese character. So you have to come to the text language from your Google Translate. So you have to look for English. So you have to look for English. Then you have to change from this point here. So you have to change this place to Chinese. Chinese simplified. Then you have to come here and type. I want to, I want to speak. I want to speak with online customer service so once you are done typing then you have to come here click on here to copy the chinese text once it's copied then you have to head over back to your 1688 customer support chat page then you come to the bottom right here and uh, you have to click and hold down and you paste your text once you paste it then the next thing you need to do is to click on here to send then this is going to pump up then from the three options here so let's translate so quality issue for the goods that's not what we are looking for the second one states that a hacked of uh fear right prosecution not the last one here none of this is looking for actual customer service so this is the last one the last one is what we are going to choose right here we are looking to speak with customer service online so you have to choose that so from these four options we have to translate and see which one is rightful to what we are looking for so the number one one here let's see uh buyer customer service merchants customer service in our own case we have we are looking for buyer customer service so we have to look we have to click the first one right here then this is going to pump up okay so let's take a translation and see what they are trying to say here you can also try to contact by phone number we don't need that so uh here the connection we don't need that so let's translate this we don't need that so what you need to do right here just click on here that we are not satisfied with the options so this is going to pump up next thing you need to do is to click on here then this is going to pump up next thing you need to do is to click on here to chat with an agent now just click on that so you can see an agent has been connected so what you need to do now is to start to type and talk to the agent so you have to head over to your google translate then you type detected in, uh, language should be english then your alternative language should be chinese chinese simplify then you have to type hello um a buyer i want to report a case of scam then you copy it and you go back to your 1688 then you have to click and hold down here paste and send it so you can see their response here so let's translate and see what they are trying to tell us they are paying wait a minute so you just go back to your Google Chrome here and you type in OK. So we are told to wait. Then you go back to your 1688. So we you can see their response here. So let's translate and see what they are trying to say. At the present, what problem are you expressing here? Then so these are just the question, and uh, we have to start the communication. So now what you need to do here you swipe this way you look for send a picture you must have the screenshot page of all the issues so you have to send them the screenshot screenshots so i have all my screenshots here so you send them the screenshot of all the issues and then you back it with information so you can see the response here you are in trouble to provide an order number so i can quickly help you check in the order so i have sent them the other information so this is the order and everything about the so they will ask for the order number so you have to provide that then uh i have more screenshots i have to send them all the screenshots then you have to back up with your information so i have about first screenshot i want to provide so this screenshot here 
contain the other number so they will sort it out i'm sorry to give your family a poor home service i'm really sorry smaller verify you for please wait a minute okay so they are verifying it so this is the other number they we are asking for in case you don't know so this is the other number of this product so they are going to work on that so uh i'm still going to send more screenshots so how the seller blocked me i think i have sent that i've sent that and i will send some of our conversation with the seller so this is one of my conversation with the seller i have about two conversation with the seller two screenshots like that so i will screenshot everything so let me translate if you don't actually receive goods or merchant suspicion suggest that you apply for a refund in time and pay attention to the entrance of complaint to the authority intervene let us take a look at the detail page to after the sales okay so they were acting for after sales page re, uh, response so i have to go back to my after sales page so you have to go back to the profile so the after sales page so this is after sales page sorry so after sales page is located down below here so this is the two products so i'm going to click on the product link here so this is after sales page i will i will screenshot it then i will go back to chat customer support then i will have to come here send a picture album screenshots recent so i'll pick the picture and send it to them so after so much chatting with 1688 so eventually i got my money back successfully all the refund was complete so i have to come back to the 1688 customer support and let them know then i will upload my uh, the proof that the money has been successfully refunded to my alipay so i have screenshot it from my alipay and i will send it to 1688 and uh, so you can see uh, i have sent them the proof you can see all our charts and uh, we, these are all my chat with 1688 customer support and uh, so at the end of the day i was able to get my refund back successfully and the refund amount is just uh 49 rmb so let me take you to my alipay and show you the refund so from my alipay right here i will go to message message then you can see the notification from the top right here 1688 i'll click on there and then you can see the refund successful and this is the other number so this is how you can get a, your money back if a seller is trying to scam you on 1688 and uh, i believe this is going to be really helpful thanks for watching and i hope to see you in my next video bye